Good morning, everyone. Back again with another daily word of encouragement here for you. Uh, Psalm 112.1 starts with, Praise the Lord. Blessed are those who fear the Lord and delight in His commandments. Fear of the Lord. We see throughout the whole Bible, fear not, fear not, fear not, fear not. With regards to your anxiety, with regards to your worldly fears, with regards to things that He knows that you cannot control, but are in fact in his control. What this fear is, is a reverence and an actual fear because he is a holy God. But the beautiful part about this is, is stepping into that type of fear relationship, not just the love relationship, not just the worship relationship, but as well the fear relationship of God, the reverence, the respect, and the actual fear of that he is a holy, mighty, all-powerful, all-present, all-knowing God You're blessed in that because what happens is when that type of fear, that reverence, that respect sits on your being, you will naturally delight in the commandments that he has given, right? Because naturally there's a cause and effect. Follow my commands, you will be blessed. Don't follow my commands, things are going to get a little hard. Yeah, so that is the plain and simple way of fearing the Lord, of being encouraged in that, and knowing that he has laid out the things that he has asked you to obey. Now, you making the choice to obey is completely up to you at the end of the day. It is, of course, guided by your nature, so especially if you are of a new spirit, renewed, born again, and live with the Holy Spirit in you, in faith in Jesus Christ, and his death and resurrection and payment of your sins. That is, you know, what will naturally or should naturally begin to come out. But you can fight it. You can definitely stifle it. You can definitely slow your own sanctification. It's not an easy road when you go that way. So fear the Lord, right? Delight in his commandments. Walk in them and you'll be blessed. Be encouraged in that. There's a method that he has laid out for you to walk in the magnificent things that he has set before you, before you were even born. Thank you all. Love you. Take care. Hope you're encouraged by this. Seek him, fear him, and know him.